I see you watching me when we're with our friends. It's definitely something in the air. So let's take it from there, cause I know you want it. Hey guys, welcome back to another vlog. It is Tuesday today, the 18th of September. I had to double check that before I started. I cannot believe it's already like middle of September. September, October, November, December. We have three months. We have three months left till the end of the year. That is insane. But the weather is still amazing and I'm so, so happy about that. It's kind of like this weird feeling where I'm still really happy that it's sunny because I love warm weather and i can wear dresses and things but then i'm also really excited for fall but i almost don't want it to come too fast because i know what's coming after and that's very cold but anyway this week is quite exciting at the end of this week mo and i will be going to jordan and if you guys don't know mo is actually from jordan he's half jordanian and i'm so so excited i've never been to jordan before and we're going to be going to the capital which is amman and in jordan there's also the dead sea and there's petra which i believe is one of the seven new wonders of the world i could be wrong but i think anyway it's a really special place and we're both so excited to go there so i think this vlog will include some of me packing and organizing for that trip and actually i am ready to go right now to the city because I want to get some things for that trip and a few days after we are back from Jordan I have a trip to London I'm so so excited I love going to London it is definitely one of my favorite cities ever so I'm really looking forward to that and I have an event to attend there this is not in focus please focus so I'll be going there to attend an event and I want to check for something nice to wear to that event so I'm gonna do that today as well so yeah I thought I would take you guys along with me today for this little shopping trip I'm gonna show you guys what I'm wearing so this is my look for today I'm wearing this dress from Zara that I showed in my a recent video which was my mini Zara haul and unboxing. It's a very lightweight dress which I love and it's got this beautiful uh, gray snake print on it. It's quite different from what I would usually wear but I still like that the color palette is quite neutral and not too like in your face but the pattern is really fun so yeah and just to give it a bit more shape I put on this waist belt which is just very thin and you don't really even see it because the the dress kind of drapes over it but I feel like it gives it a little bit more shape and then on the bottom I've got my Dior sneakers that I got um, this summer I love these sneakers so much and I like the little Jador a print on the laces they're just super cute very comfy and i like the dress and like sneaker look then i have my classic chanel flat bag and my sunnies are from celine so we are in the car it is 24.5 degrees celsius isn't that just lovely? Sometimes I wish that I could live in a place that has summer. I would have like spring, summer, fall. We just skip the winter. Can we do that? Oh, if there was a place like that. I, I really do like fall. I do, I do like spring and I like summer. It's just the winter part that I usually have troubles with. But, um, but I'm going to make a really conscious effort this year to try to embrace the winter and not let it you know like get me down too much I haven't figured out how I'm gonna do that yet but when I figure it out I will share it with you guys and we'll see how it works it is around one o'clock now so I am hungry for some lunch I think before we start our shopping trip I'm gonna get some food and just fuel myself up but I'm motivated you guys I'm motivated to find some really nice things for both the Jordan trip but also for um, my event in London and also then for fall. I want to do a really nice fall haul for you guys and I want to go to Mango, to H&M, to Zara as well. Hopefully just get like some really good stuff that you guys would also really like and I like to go to stores like that that are international so wherever you guys live then hopefully you'll be able to get those things if you do like them because sometimes I am tempted to get stuff from like smaller stores or boutiques they're just not available all over the world so that's why I 
do like to shop at places like that that they'll be available to anyone and everyone who wants them the trees are starting to turn like a darker green it's like almost like an orangey green so that's when you really know that like fall is coming so it's oh my god now it says it's 27 degrees you guys that's insane but I'm not gonna complain I'm just gonna soak it all in I should probably turn this off right now otherwise I will sit here and ramble about the weather for a very long time but I will check back with you guys when I'm in the city <music> are the two dresses that I found. I think this one might be nice for the event in London and this one is just so so pretty. I don't know how it's going to be now for the fall time but I I want to try them on. They're both from Self Portrait. So this is the first dress. It's quite pretty. I would obviously wear it with heels so I have to kind of imagine that. I like that it cinches in at the waist but I don't know if it's like too heavy on the fabric, if you know what I mean. Now this dress I really, really love. I love this like white crochet and the shape and this like panel here and the black little ab belt as well. That is so, so pretty. But I don't know how practical this is for fall or even for like a fall time event. I feel like it is quite summery. was a success hello guys it is now friday it's been about two days now since i checked back in with this vlog i've actually been filming and editing for another video that's going to go live on wednesday we'll be coming back on wednesday so yeah i just wanted it to be ready and i'm not the best at multitasking so i kind of have to like focus on one video at a time but um anyway so we're back with this vlog. Shopping earlier this week went really well. I found a really nice dress that I think will be perfect for the event. I also got something really nice from Chloe. Ah! So excited. And I also placed a last minute order on ASOS for some things that I needed for Jordan. And they just arrived and they're super pretty. So I will show those to you guys as well. So first let me show you guys what I got from Chloe. Ah! So this is the beautiful bag that I got. I believe it's called the Mino Die, Mino Die, Mini Mino Die, something like that. It is so cute, and I think it's going to be a really nice evening bag. I love the gold um, details on the bag. It's kind of like an accessory in itself. It is so beautiful so it does have this kind of gold um bracelet detail on the top of the bag and you can either hold it in your hand like this or you could slip it through your arm or you could have it just laying on the front of the bag it does come with a strap as well so you could wear it cross body i also really love this coin detail here on um, the bottom and then this gold piece here is just so beautiful and this is what the inside of the bag looks like so it's obviously not a very big bag but it does fit my phone really well and then my vlogging camera i'm not sure but it will definitely fit a, a powder and like a lipstick or something like that my keys but i think as an evening bag it's going to be really really nice i'm actually going to try on that dress that i got i'm going to show you guys what that looks like and then i will definitely have this bag with that so this is the dress that i got for my event in london it is from maj i like that it's quite long as well it's very elegant and 
chic the pattern is really pretty as well it's got a bit of red and gray and black and I really love this sleeve so it has this kind of like ruffled um, detail kind of extends there on one shoulder so I feel like it's very elegant really chic and I think the bag just goes perfectly with it I really like the whole bracelet collection of bags at Chloe I also really like their I think it's just called the small Nile bracelet bag which I also had a look at I had a look at it in the motto gray color super super pretty as well but I thought this would be perfect for like a, a cute evening bag that would go with pretty much everything since I got it in the black color. And this is a dress that I got from ASOS that I will be bringing with me to Jordan. And I think it is so perfect for where we're going. So obviously it's gonna be super hot, but I want it to be quite covered. So I don't wanna wear anything too short or too exposing. And so this dress is just gonna be amazing so i ordered this from asos but the brand is french connection so the quality is a little bit more premium and like it feels really good so i'm really happy with this dress as well and uh, this will definitely be coming with me i just changed my outfit and i wanted to see how the bag looked with a more casual outfit and i love it as well i'm gonna put the strap on actually and see what it would look like um cross body So this is the bag worn crossbody and I really like it like this as well. It is its own little accessory in itself. But now I have to take this off and I'm going to start packing for this trip. I'm going to do all of my clothes first and like little things like underwear, socks, gym clothes, things like that. And then I'll move into my bathroom, grab my skincare, my makeup. We're just going for four days so it's not a very long trip so I'm going to pack per day so that I know exactly what I'm going to be wearing so that I don't bring like a whole bunch of stuff because it is so short and we kind of already know what we're doing on all of the days so um yes let's get started with that So I've laid out what I will be bringing with me and I've kind of grouped them into outfits. So this is one outfit here. This is a little bit more of a formal outfit. This is for Sunday when we're going to be seeing his family. And then I have two day outfits right there. Another kind of like nicer option. This is a dress. These are shoes over here. We've got two bags, a swimming suit. This is my gym gear, my workout shoes, underwear. And yeah, that's pretty much it for the clothes. That's mostly like the clothes that I'm gonna pack. I still need an outfit for tomorrow, but that's gonna be like my travel outfit. And then I think I'll wear something similar on the way back. I was having a bit of a difficult time packing for the day at Petra because I think we're gonna be walking a lot. So I don't think I can wear like regular sandals. I think I have to wear sneakers so that I'm comfortable, but I still wanna look cute and have like a dress on. So I'm still kind of figuring that one out but everything else I'm feeling pretty good about so I'm gonna put everything into my suitcase and then we're gonna move on to like face stuff so skincare makeup and um, accessories and things like that When it comes to my makeup products, I like to pack them in order of application so that I make sure I don't forget anything. I'm gonna pack these two base products for my skin because they're very lightweight and I don't think that I'm gonna be wearing like too much makeup. This is pretty much the makeup that I'm gonna have there. I just like mixing a little bit of those on my fingertips and then applying it directly to my skin. I'm gonna take my NARS Radiant Creamy Concealers in two different colors. I've got ginger and custard. Then my Laura Mercier Translucent Setting Powder. Should I show you guys what I'm looking at? Okay, so this is the first drawer of my makeup organization. This is all um, base products. I'm gonna take my two bronzers and my favorite blush at the moment, which is from MAC. It's the one in Melba. It looks like that. And my highlighter. This is also my current favorite from Dior. My brow powder and my brow brush, which is this. 
my lash curlers i love these these are from kevin aquan i use these two mascaras this first one is from charlotte tilbury it's the um legendary lashes volume two and for my lower lashes i like this one from Chantecaille. this is almost finished but i like this for my lower lashes because the wand is quite slim and then lips we've got my boldly bare lip liner with pillow tuck lipstick that has been my go-to combo i also like this liner from marc jacobs it's like a nice golden metallic and then my brow gel this is from ico what else oh and a setting spray i need a setting spray this one is really good from Urban Decay. It's the D Slick. And then for my makeup brushes, I like this little pouch. So I just slide my makeup brushes into these little compartments and it keeps it nice and organized. So these are my face brushes that I like to use. And then on this side, I just put my smaller brushes that I like. Maybe this one as well. So those are pretty much all the brushes that I use on a regular basis. I will also put my beauty blender in here wrapped in a tissue just to keep it clean. Yeah, that's pretty much it. Then I just close it up and it's nice and compact. My makeup is now nice and organized, but I will still be reaching for this tomorrow morning when I'm getting ready. But I like that it's already ready to go and in its bag so that tomorrow I just use everything, put it back, and I know I'm not gonna forget anything. So that is done. And now I'm gonna do the same for my skincare. So this is the skincare that I'm gonna take with me. And again, I like to pack this in order of how I would do my skincare again just to make sure that I don't forget anything so I've got my contact lens solution and um, like little case makeup remover this is for my face this is for my eyes and I have these small um, containers that I get from Muji and I have a little label maker so I just put on like what it is and it's really great for traveling we've got cleanser I have two because I'm extra and I love my cleansers so we've got the Indie Lee brightening cleanser and the Kate Somerville eradicate and then some toners. I got these in a recent package from Cult Beauty. You guys might have seen that in um, that same video, the Zara haul and uh, unboxing. So this is perfect timing. And then these are my two serums. This is a day serum and a night serum. And then my moisturizers. The Sunday Riley one I've been using pretty much the whole summer. It's really, really nice. And then I also love this one from La Mer. This is the Intensive Revitalizing Mask. But I like to use this at night because it's super super moisturizing but still like not too heavy so I really really love this and then just a couple of tools so that's all gonna go into this uh, cosmetic case right here For fragrance, I'm going to take this one from Jo Malone. This is the Jasmine Sandback and Marigold. It is so, so good. It's the only fragrance I've been wearing the last few weeks. I absolutely love it. I also need my sunglasses. These are my favorites by Celine. I think that's pretty much it for the packing. I still have to do my electronics, my charging cable, extra batteries, uh, like computer stuff. And that will also have its own little pouch, of course. <laughs> and now I'm hungry. So I'm going to get something to eat and um, probably start editing this footage because this video has to go up on Sunday. So I'm going to get organized and I will catch up with you guys a little bit later. Good morning everyone, we are all set and ready to go. This is my travel outfit today. It's actually quite cold today, so I'm wearing this cashmere sweater from Reese and it's um, 
like a turtleneck so it's going to keep me nice and warm on the plane as well and then my jeans are from a gold i just got these these are going to be featured in my haul very soon but i just couldn't wait to wear them they just fit me so so well and they're super comfortable and then my sneakers are dior these are the ones that you guys saw earlier i like that they're a little bit more of a smart type of sneaker and then my bag is from celine this is the bag that i always travel with on flights because it is quite spacious so we've got two pouches one of them has um, electronics and stuff that I will need for um, the airport this is beauty products a book a highlighter for the book because I love to highlight while I'm reading some hand lotion passports a pair of socks for the plane like thick socks so all of that is good to go and I've got my suitcase right here Mo is still just closing his up Are you gonna know where we get where you're gonna fly to? Do they know? Thank you guys so much for watching this video. I hope that you enjoyed it and I will see you back here on Wednesday with a new video. Bye!